Miguel Saba Rodriguez is a Mexican former professional footballer who played as a striker. Throughout his career, he played for Guadalajara, Cruz Azul, Monarcas Morelia, and Club León. Saba made his debut in the Invierno 2000 with Guadalajara entering in the 46th minute. Saba played five years with Guadalajara until transferring to Cruz Azul in the Apertura 2006. Saba was transferred to Morelia in the Clausura 2009, where he was the best Mexico-born goalscorer of the season with 11 goals. Saba made 17 appearances for the Mexico national team and was the top scorer of the 2009 CONCACAF Gold Cup. Saba started his career with Club Deportivo Guadalajara, making his debut on August 12, 2000, coming in the 46th minute for Benjamin Galindo against his future team Cruz Azul. Although making his debut in the third game of the season, Saba did not appear in any games until the Verano 2002 season. In the Verano 2002 season Saba played in 16 games, including 11 starts, and scored 3 goals. His second full season with Guadalajara did not go very well, Saba appeared in only six games and did not score any goals. The Clausura 2003 season was similar to the previous season, Saba appeared in eight games, and scored no goals for the second consecutive season. Saba improved in the 2003 Apertura 2003 season, appearing in 18 games, and scoring eight goals. Saba appeared in 11 games the following season the season which Guadalajara reached the final. Saba appeared in the first leg match against Unum Pumas, coming in the 75th minute for Hector Reynoso. He did not appear in the second leg match, eventually Chivas lost the final 5-4 in penalty kicks. In the Apertura 2004 season, Saba would appear in 14 games, Saba managed to score 5 goals, but got a red card against Atlante FC in the first game of the season. Without Saba, Guadalajara defeated Atlante 7-0. Saba appeared in 12 games combined in his last two seasons with Guadalajara. Saba appeared in 86 games and scored 18 goals in nine seasons with Guadalajara. Following the Apertura 2005 Saba was transferred to Cruz Azul, which helped his career get going. His first season with Cruz Azul was solid, with Saba scoring three goals and registering two assists. Saba had a very good Apertura 2006 season, he appeared in 18 games, starting 15 and he scored 10 goals. The Clausura 2007 season was not as good as the previous season for Saba, he scored 6 goals in 17 games. The Apertura 2007 season was statistically the best season for Saba with Cruz Azul. Saba started all 17 games he played and scored 11 goals. Although Saba only scored 11 goals in 37 games, Cruz Azul reached the final in Saba's last two seasons with that club. Cruz Azul lost both of those finals, Clausura 2008 to Santos Laguna and Apertura 2008 to Deportivo Toluca. On December 28, 2008, Miguel Saba was transferred to Monarcas Morelia. He was presented on December 31. Saba scored his first goal with Morelia on January 31, 2009 against America. The rest of the Clausura 2009 season for Saba with Morelia has gone well. Saba started out slow but has responded with 11 goals in 17 games, 15 in which he started. In his second tournament with Morelia, Saba only appeared in 16 matches due to national team duty but still managed to score 8 goals, including 2 in the playoffs. The Torneo B Centenario 2010 was a very good season for Saba as he finished with 7 goals in 13 matches before he left for Mexico national team pre-World Cup training camp. In the Clausura 2011 season, Saba and teammate Rafael Marquez Lugo formed a dangerous attacking duo for a Morelia team who reached the league final. Between the two they scored a total of 17 goals for Morelia who eventually fell 3-2 on aggregate to Unum. In three years in Morelia, Saba scored 64 goals. Which makes him the club's third all-time scorer behind Marco Antonio Figueroa and Alex Fernandez, he is also the club's all-time Mexico-born scorer. Miguel Saba transferred to his first club, Chivas on December 14, 2012 and was presented on December 17, 2012. On January 6, 2013 in the Fecha 1 in the Clausura 2013, Miguel Saba scored his first goal in a 1-1 tie against Toluca. Later in that match he was sent off with a red card. On November 27, 2013, Miguel Saba was traded to Leon. During the 2014 Clausura season he managed to play key role in game against Santos Laguna, final score 4-2, where he had three assists and a goal. He then ended up becoming champions with Leon, giving him his first career Liga MX championship. On November 29, 2015, 
Manager Juan Antonio Pizzi announced that Sabah, as well as his teammate Gonzalo Rios would not continue with the team for the Clausura 2016, both ended contract with the club. After being released by Leon, Sabah did not find a team in the Liga MX draft and he eventually announced his retirement on January 5, 2016 in a press conference in Guadalajara. In 2017 Sabah started playing for Corinthians FC of San Antonio of the National Premier Soccer League. Sabah was called up by Mexico national team coach Javier Aguirre on May 15, 2009 for the 2010 World Cup qualifiers against El Salvador and Trinidad and Tobago. Sabah earned his first international cap against Trinidad and Tobago, coming in for Neri Castillo in the 34th minute. Aguirre included Sabah on the 2009 CONCACAF Gold Cup roster. Sabah scored his first international goal on July 9, 2009 against Panama, that goal was the 500th goal in CONCACAF Gold Cup history. On August 12, 2009, Sabah also scored a late winner against the United States in a crucial CONCACAF World Cup qualifying match. However, he was not on the final list for the 2010 FIFA World Cup due to an injury. Miguel Sabah Rodriguez is of Lebanese descent on his father's side. He was born in Cancun, Mexico. As of August 19, 2012, Cruz Azul Morelia Leon, Mexico individual category. Thanks for watching.